It is time to put in the fourth course of struts. I'm saying how exciting today's gonna be. Okay. If all goes well, today is the last day I'll have to keep retarping these struts because by the end of the day, they will all be used. Time to remove the temporary risers. Okay. Wow, I didn't think you were actually gonna get that to go out. You doubt me? <laughs> Since we only put the pins in part way, hopefully that'll make it a little bit easier to just pull those apart, remove the hub, and then these struts will become available to use up there. Got a scissor lift. Look what we have. This is going to make this job a lot easier. Oh, come on, that looks like fun. <laughs> yeah, that's up there pretty good. Going to work? I'm going to say yes either way. Would you rather use that? I'm not rather in anything. I'm just here. I'm trying to figure out on the first one when we, it's going to be standing there by itself. Yes. There they go. They're taking up the first two struts to the fourth course. which means they're probably gonna be at the platform about 21 feet at this point. And going up from there. That looks good. Just don't look down. Don't think you're helping. <laughs> the first strut is going up. Is that up and down? I can't see. Uh, it's gotta go to the left. A little bit. It's hard to tell. That looks pretty good. They're trying to figure out how to get the second strut up to complete this first triangle. These angles are crazy way up there. As is the height, of course. Okay, looks like they just got the strut into the hub. to get higher up. Oh wow, this is challenging. Alright, this time they're pinning in the base of that strut and then they'll worry about the top next. I think that's a better way to do it. Okay, looks like one triangle is done. Still a lot to go. Alright, you got the first two up. Are you willing to keep working with us? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm not quitting. It looks like they're starting to get the hang of this up there. So they got another couple struts up. It looks like one of the big dark ones is going up now. Here goes another one. And they're putting in a blue strut as a topper. So this is a little bit different from the triangle ones. Boy, the scissor lift is definitely coming in handy. That angle is so much it's almost vertical. Well, looks like they're gonna get it. <sighs> what do you think so far? It's high up there. What, up there? And that scissor lift is way more swayable than the scaffolding. 
yet I still feel more comfortable in this. I mean, just looking at it, it seems like that should be way sturdier. It, yeah, it's not. I don't feel like we're going to tip over like I do with scaffolding, so. Well, it's coming along. We're making it. That's all that's left to fill in. Alright, break time is done. Any more words before you finish this last round? He's ignoring me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, wind blow. Yeah. And of course, the wind is picking up. Oh, looks like that one's giving him a little bit of trouble. Got it. Whew, impressive. The last red one is going up. There. I keep having to back up farther and farther. <laughs> this thing is so big. That red strut is in. That means once they get that pinned in, there's two to go, two blue ones. Wow, we're so close. We're probably 26 or so. All right, the guess is that we're about 26 feet up. And by we, I mean they. Look at this. This is the last strut on the pallets. And the pallets are empty. Well, at least these two. There's still a lot more to go. But this is a definite victory. The last strut is heading up. And that will close the Pentagon up top. There it goes. It's in! Well done. Thanks. Come on, that was a big deal. Look at this. That was some work right wow. there. Wow! We're not done yet though. We're not done yet. So explain what's going on next. Next is the cupola, Cup cupola parts. Yeah, there's five more struts for now. Yeah. And we'll show you what those look like. Yep. Job's never finished. We have work to do. We are going to have a cupola. Cupola? I say cupola. Up top as sort of a mini third floor and in order to build that this is what's next we're going to have five vertical corner struts that will stick up out of that pentagon at the top of the dome and that is where we will build the surrounding cupola from looks like they're giving it a go the brace was already pre-installed so all they have to do is hopefully slot it right in to the existing hub. Ooh, looks like they got that first one up. One is up, four to go. Heading up with the second one. Thank you, you may continue. Oops. We won't finish building the cupola frame until after we put the plywood around the skin of the whole dome. So these are going to be hanging out there by themselves for a little while. Fifth and final vertical corner strut is ready to go right up at the top of that pentagon. And that'll be the last strut for the day. You guys ready to put the last one up? Yes. <laughs> that was unanimous. Yep. <laughs> All right, 
right, I have to give a tremendous thank you again to our friend for helping us make this happen. Strong back, weak mind. <laughs> <laughs> well, whatever, it works, I'll take it. Thank you. Much appreciated. Today was a really, really good day. So the plywood triangles are the next big, big job that's coming up next. Yep. First, we have to figure out how to make that happen. But in the meantime, thanks for watching. If you enjoy our videos, we'd really appreciate it if you would take a second and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. And until next time, like our farm sign says, just keep growing.